new video has been released by Mr. Sky. Feel free to check it out. Link in description. This is Story Recapped. Today, I'm going to explain a horror mystery thriller film called The Den. Spoilers ahead. Watch out and take care. On a typical day, Elizabeth logs into her account in The Den, a webcam-based social networking program that allows users to interact with random people from all over the world. She connects with a young boy who greets her and asks if they can be friends. Elizabeth politely accepts his offer. Then the boy tells her that there's a monster in his closet. As she consoles him, the boy heads into his wardrobe where a ghost appears behind the boy, shocking Elizabeth. The boy captures her reaction as a part of his prank. Later that day, she watches a recording of a previous meeting with the board of graduates online. There she presented her psychology project regarding human behavior in front of the webcam. She aims to talk with as many strangers as possible, using the den to record and analyze their behaviors online. While waiting for the proposal's result, she randomly chats with her friends who cheer her up and hope for the best. Finally, with the assistance of Sally, one of her graduate board friends, the board reluctantly grants her proposal. She immediately informs her friend and her boyfriend, Damien, who even video calls her to congratulate her. A little while later, Elizabeth begins her research by customizing the site's settings, removing all the filters that prevent her from interacting with random people worldwide. She confirms the site's warning of not being responsible for whatever she might see while interacting. On her first day, she is quickly exposed to the dark side of interacting with people online. She meets predators, a flasher, and she even witnesses a bike accident while using the site. That night, her friend, Jenny, joins her in her research while drinking beer. The two entertain themselves by the randomness of people online. They encounter a group of teenagers having fun, a cat grooming itself, and even a man dancing in his bunny onesie. They come across a young Indian girl whose camera appears broken, but Jenny skips her as she finds her boring. When Elizabeth heads to the bathroom, the strange woman comes back and becomes harsh with Jenny, prompting her to log out. That night, Elizabeth's account is hacked and her webcam turns on on its own without her permission. The laptop records her while sleeping, then suddenly it logs into her den's account and connects to the strange woman earlier who only displays her picture. Suddenly, the sound of a woman crying in pain resonates from Elizabeth's laptop, waking her up. The following morning, Elizabeth calls her IT friend Max and inquires about what happened last night. According to him, the laptop can't turn on unless there's a ghost in her apartment. Max jokes around before hanging up the call. In a coffee shop, the Indian girl connects with Elizabeth once again. The stranger talks to her through the chat, asking if they can be friends. When a guy approaches Elizabeth, the stranger hurriedly ends the call. That night, Elizabeth still interacts with people. After the nonsense calls, she finally meets Brian, who unlike the others, converses with her in a composed manner. Elizabeth then receives an email from Sally asking about her progress. When she's about to reply, Damien calls her and asks her to join him for a drink, but Elizabeth refuses as she has work to do. Damien is disappointed as Elizabeth is so busy with her project that she forgets that he will leave the city tomorrow for work. He invites her on his trip, but still Elizabeth declines. Later that night, her laptop logs in alone once again, but this time someone carries it to her bed and records her as the hand caresses her skin. Elizabeth wakes up and to her surprise, Rise, Damien visits her in the middle of the night. The couple kisses passionately, but Elizabeth turns off the webcam before making love, despite Damien's protest. Unbeknownst to them, the site logs in again and captures the intimate moment that the hacker sends to the graduate board members. The following day, Elizabeth is motivated to speak with strangers again. She encounters the Indian girl again, who discloses that she likes watching people, like how she watched Elizabeth and her boyfriend last night. Alarmed, Elizabeth is speechless until the stranger's webcam finally opens. It shows a disturbing video of the Indian girl tied up and gagged as a masked man slits her throat on screen. Terrified, Elizabeth quickly reports